Pickup trucks nobody wants to buy. Despite being iconic and robust, some of these trucks just aren't moving off dealership lots fast enough. Today, some of the reasons behind the poor sales numbers, and of course, the sources behind those numbers. Let's begin with the Ram 1500 Classic. According to iccars.com, sales have been particularly poor, especially in Arkansas. Despite being the most affordable in its classic series with an MSRP of 32 and change, the 1500 Classic sales are slow because it's based on an old design dating back to 2009. With a brand new 2024 Ford F-150 costing about $4,000 more at MSRP, it's easy to see why this ancient truck isn't flying off the lots. Next, the current Ram 1500 also needs help making it off dealership lots, spending around 62 days on average in Idaho before being sold there, according to IC Cars. With an MSRP of $39.5, it's more expensive than the 2024 Ford F-150 and Chevrolet Silverado, which retail between $36,000 and $37,000. This price disparity is likely contributing to the slower sales. Next, the Ram 2500. It isn't going so well for Ram at the moment. Car Edge recently reported that four of the five slowest selling vehicles currently on the U.S. markets are from Stellantis. One of those is the Ram 2500 pickup the slowest selling vehicle in the U.S. Ram Forum says that there are a 784 day supply for this vehicle, which is unbelievable. One user suggested that its pricing is to blame as a 2500 costs $11,000 more than the equivalent F350. The Nissan Titan is suffering from similar issues with Car Edge reporting a 265 market day supply. The average selling price for the Titan stands at 56.2 and Nissan sold just 1,000 over the last 45 days as of January 2024. Its MSRP of 46 grand is significantly higher than Ford and Chevrolet's offerings, also contributing to its poor sales numbers. The Ram 3500 is also one of the slowest selling trucks in the U.S. that nobody wants to buy, with a 367 market day supply and a MSRP of 77.8. For context, the 2024 Ford Super Duty F-150 XL cost just around 45 grand. And the F-350 XL is priced at 52, making the Ram 3500 seem a little overpriced. Chevy Silverado 1500 Limiteds are struggling in the market as well, spending around 61 days on average before selling. Priced at 46.4, they fall within the range of new Ford and Chevy pickups, which offer better value. Sales for the 2023 Tacoma have dropped dramatically with the advent of the 2024 model, Good Car, Bad Car reveals that Toyota sold 18,674 Tacomas in March of 2023, but only 8,300 in March of 2024. That's a significant drop. The hype around the new model has significantly impacted the sales of the older version. The Nissan Frontier has seen fluctuating sales, with Good Car, Bad Car reporting 60,700 sold in 2021, increasing to 76,000 in 2022, but dropping to 58,000 in 2023. This year, only 20,000 have been sold so far, highlighting the stiff competition from rivals. The Jeep Gladiator sales have decreased over the years. Good Car, Bad Car lists sales at under 90,000 in 2021, dropping to 78,000 in 2022, and further down to 55,000 last year. This year so far, around 13,000 have been sold. Despite its impressive towing capacity and off-road performance, it is struggling in the marketplace. The Ford F-150 Lightning, despite being new, has appeared on slow sales lists. IC Cars reported it as the eighth slowest selling used vehicle in October of 2023, with an average of 78 days in the market. Ford Authority also noted a 45% decrease in new truck sales through the third quarter of 2023. With this information at hand, now you know which vehicles to concentrate if you are in the market for a new or used vehicle. If so, check out quotes.everymandriver.com to find the best deals being offered in your zip code. That's quotes.everymandriver.com, insider access to dealer pricing. Make, model, and zip code. If you don't find what you're looking for in your zip code, expand that zip code. Be willing to travel a few miles to save a few hundred, possibly a few thousand dollars on a new or used vehicle of your choice by visiting quotes.everymandriver.com. There's also a link below this video. That's my video for today. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and click subscribe if you haven't already. It's free and it really helps support this channel. See you next time.
Today's video is brought to you by The Cold Plunge. Use discount code DAVE150 at checkout at thecoldplunge.com. Immediately save $150 off your purchase. That's DAVE150 at thecoldplunge.com. There's also a link below this video.